we have finally made it to the last of the, of the challenge themes for Ford Racing 2's challenge mode, the stock cars. I don't know what to expect, but we'll have to see. So three of the four are all standard races. Only the Class B is different, which is elimination. But we start off with the Class D at Rock City Raceway for a standard race. Trying to get these cars to work with you is a nightmare. This race wouldn't be that bad if the AI knew what the fuck they were doing. It's very clear they've never watched a NASCAR race. Because you know how with NASCAR you really got to work with with drive it with uh, being in packs and uh, building off of slipstreams to slingshot by. Yeah, they never. W I don't think they know how any of that works. Like they always build a bit of a gap at the start here, despite my best efforts. They all they go in like five wide. They crash. They always have a crash. And then I could then I could try and start, you know, doing this. But the problem is they always keep getting so separated apart from each other that it never seems to actually fucking matter. And even when I try, even when I purposely try to do this, I push them, I push them, I push them. They they want to try and uh, you know, maybe they're going to try and move they, a lot of times they usually will swerve out of the way. I'm actually lucky that this guy is finally listening. I was about to say if you if you hit that if you hit that pat if you hit the curve I was gonna be so mad. Psst, do do not you you are right here. We can do we can do this. We can we can build enough speed to catch up to the blue car and and do this. It's so funny how the first attempt I was right in there because of it. And now every attempt since has been a problem because the, the field splits up too much. This finally seems like the one where everything where it's actually coming together again. Mother, motherfucker in versus the Jeff Gordon T-Rex, clearly. Okay, now, now we're in the front, finally, again. This is the third racing game I've played. Oh, and there goes the blue cart. <laughs> This is the third racing game I played where the big oval track has the start finish line on the flat back track and not the fucking tri oval. I'm gonna try and keep this uh, orange 57 guy uh, up with me. Excuse you, sir. That's just rude. I'd be lying if I say maybe I am trying to intimidate them. I'm just going to go for the pass here. All right, we're good. That took too long because of how this how the AI is here, but we did we did finally get the run that mattered. Yeah, it's a new record. Car collected. So there's the first of the Taurus is collected. collected. And the track. And now we move on. We move over to the C class at Black Ridge Speedway. It's night time. So basically, yeah, the C class cars are look a little bit visual, have a f some visual differences, and are fast and are faster. 
You can imagine how it works for B and A. Just think of it as different horsepower packages. It's, uh, Chris, basically, it's, this game always is worth the, whatever is the default paint job for a vehicle, that's what they, you use. So that's, so for these vehicles, the black is considered the default paint job. Yeah, it's like Goody's Dash, Arca, Bush, Xfinity, and Cup, I'd assume. Probably pretty, pr pr probably exactly how that works, I imagine. At least here, it's, even though they are... Uh, they still don't they don't ha they still don't have much in the way of spatial awareness they are driving a lot more like it's an oval though I don't know why they let off there <laughs> kind of a not kind of knockoff Pocono They really like to let off that one corner. I am in, I am indeed streaming GT effect. There you go, that was a sub-41. Yeah, that's understandable. Gee, I'm doing alright. I've... This is, honestly, for the few streams I've been doing on and off over the last few months, this, despite how this game has made me feel at times, this has been one of my better streams, honestly. My sub count went up. My sub count actually went up by quite a few, by quite a few as well. And I got a, I had gotten a few new follows, gotten a raid. Been pretty good so far. Okay, I gotta hope that that last cut, that that second place car stays far back enough. But considering that last corner, they always keep letting off. I think I should be okay. I don't know why they always let off in that corner. It's very weird, but I'll take it. Um, I think there was a new best on my last one, too. Oh, never mind. It was probably the same. There it goes. First try, at least with the C-Class one, so that's good. And there it is. Black Ridge Speedway unlocked. That's two down, two to go. Now for the only elimination. The only elimination type of this one, the B class at Club Raceway, which means, uh, hope you enjoy Death Corner because we're going to experience it again.
Yeah, more details and stuff. Okay. Gotta pass one more. Running out of time. Oh, come on. There we go. There we go. Keep keeping ourselves alive. All right. <laughs> that was a bit of a dive bomb, I will admit, but it, uh, it, it did work. Oh, sorry. Ah, Got to get out of the way. Playing my R4 rules, yeah. That would be a good game to stream at some point soon, R4. But you know what? If we're going to do playthroughs, what, if I'm going to do that, I need to play Ridge Racer Revolution first. The only Ridge Racer game I've ever played uh, fully on the channel is the first one. And I kind of do want to play Ridge Racer Revolution, so... Indy RC turn Indy Road Course turn one bullshit I just pulled. You know what? Look, if if it works, it works. That's my excuse. And I'll, okay, the good news is at least here it looks like Death Corner is not really a problem because this car at least is is tolerating it. This car seems a lot more stable than the than the GT's that that GT was. This is this thing actually can doesn't like the curbs, but it but uh, Death. Uh, I'll mention it when which one Jet Corner is GT effect. Death Corner. This is Death Corner right here. When I was doing this with the GT, I had to do a race here with the GT in the last part, and the GT would keep spitting out constantly from that corner. It did not like that that corner whatsoever. That's why. So I dubbed it Death Corner. Oh, I'm not gonna get it enough. Oh, I, <laughs> I didn't put them into the grass. They kind of did that on their own. You win. I didn't do that. I did not do that. They put themselves in the grass, not me. I'm take I'm not taking responsibility for that. <laughs> but hey, I'll take the win. <laughs> All right, final race, final one of this of this challenge Ford challenge, and then Ford challenge is done, and that is a standard race at the International Raceway with the A class tourist stock car. All right, so. It's, it would be a game like Ford Racing 2 that would decide that the best of these vehicles for, the, for this sort of class would should go around a track like this instead of an oval, which would have been better. Just... This, but Ford Racing 2 just doesn't care. Honestly, Reflect Story, if you do play this game, just play it on play it on a lower difficulty. Don't put yourself through uh, the stress of playing this on hard like I've been doing. <laughs> we are doing better though. We already are we're already in first, and I just Which Gonna try and take these corners a little more carefully. That would probably be the best idea. The copy doesn't work anymore. Oops. Yes, I know that's not the fastest I've taken that. I don't care. I'm in first right now. I'm just doing what I can to keep everything under control. All right, it's fine. I'm being, I'm being cautious, I'm 
after the uh, previous attempts, I've the, me just trying to be cautious right now is is what I'm trying to use as my key to success. And right now, I think that's working out. That's probably been my problem throughout most of this playthrough, I'm going to be honest, is that I wasn't being careful enough. It's too easy to, for me, I think, to, to uh, take more advantage of this than I actually can, and I think that's probably been my downfall. Like, I'm trying to, like, you know, I'm trying to, like, be more reasonable than just, you know, be pointing it towards the game, because, you know, too many people do that, and I've been doing that enough too much, too, tonight. Oh, my... Oh, wow. He completely lost it. Thank you, though. That makes my life a little bit easier. I will gladly take you doing that. Okay. Be careful. Did not put much. Uh, didn't put too much throttle there, because that corner has gotten me a couple times. Kept it in fourth to, to uh, keep it low, keep the RPMs low. Okay. We are almost home. Oh, don't don't go too wide now. And we are in the green, boys. We have finally finished Ford Challenge. Oh, there we go. <laughs> All right, you shattered that wreck car. And there we go. Upgrade. Ford Legend driver rating. Add the stock car trophy. You have won the Ford Challenge trophy. There we go. That is it. Ford challenge is complete. We go into the details. Every vehicle is unlocked. All the tracks unlocked. All the race types collected. We just need to get the, the stuff in Ford collection. Trophy cabinet. Which is basically just do all of the... Basically just uh, this. I f oh god, I forgot it was every track too. I honestly forgot it was every track. I'm not going to lie. I thought you just had to do it once. I guess that would make sense. But yeah, I don't think I'm going to be doing that tonight. I probably won't even really... D I'll, what I'll probably just do is I... like I'll probably just do it off screen for the most part. I get it, get most of it taken care of the way, and then just leave leave like one event to do, so then I can then show it on screen, uh, getting the tr getting the trophies for each one, because that's just gonna take too long if I did it for every track for this, because there is a total of 16 tracks, and you have to do it on every track, 16, 32, 48, 64, 78. I'm, I'm trying to remember, trying to do the math in my head correctly. Ninety-four, I think. Yeah, it's a hundred and twenty-eight, a hundred and twenty-eight races I got to do. Basically, that's gonna take a while, and uh, technically, I've already hit the Ford Legend bit. Which is uh, the last of the rating medals I can get. So yeah. Oh, it's eight out of seventy. Okay, I'm my I'm failing math right now. <laughs> that was why I think that's why I got confused. Anyways, but yeah, that's gonna do it though for for this part. Uh, the next part's probably gonna be a, a little bit of a while. I'm gonna do try and do this off screen if I have the patience enough to do it. 
but we'll see. So stay tuned for that. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to uh, uh, check out my links down below and also check out my Twitch if you want to see these happen live as they do. This is pretty much where the main portion of, the, of this playthrough ends, but I will show that extra bit off just for the sake of completionism. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope to see you all in the next video.